Okay, let's get started. Uh, so want to welcome you guys all to our 10th annual Solar Installer Conference. Uh, it's amazing. Uh, this has been a crazy last, gosh, it has been 12 months since this all started with COVID. Uh, and uh, I know at one point in time, we even thought that we weren't going to have this conference, but uh, uh, our team pulled it off. And uh, I am pleased to say that we have more over more, more attendees this year expected over the course of the week uh, than we've had in any prior year. We'll share that with you shortly. Um, this year outside of COVID has absolutely been strange. Uh, we at Alt E um, were expecting the worst and in many ways it, it has been a terrible last 12 months, but uh, especially with COVID and uh, trying to keep our, set, our staff safe to ensure that we can fulfill your orders as quickly as possible. Um, and, you know, we've, we've been wrestling with supply issues as I'm sure many of you guys have. It's, you know, supply issues that have been occurring all over the globe. Uh, but I can say that our team has worked tirelessly, and I mean tirelessly, tirelessly um, whether they're working from home or one of our warehouses or one of our offices. Um, so many people have been working so hard, I'd say we've, we've been working harder than we have in any other year, and that's really unexpected for given all that's happened. So with no further ado, let's, uh, let's get going with the uh, conference. So the, la the first conference we had, I don't know how many folks on the line were with us, but our very first conference was uh, far less virtual than it is this time. Uh, we had our very first conference at a ski resort in New Hampshire. And if some of you guys were with us back in those days, not only was skiing an option, but snow was very much an option, something that doesn't seem to be an option here in the Northeast uh, lately. Uh, but uh, I know that a lot of us got locked in thanks to a snowstorm that blocked people from traveling home, our secret way of keeping people around for a little longer. Uh, and then, you know, just last year we had uh, what we thought was our largest conference yet uh, uh, with attendees from around the world. Um, and uh, we are very pleased that uh, here we are again and, uh, with folks from all over the globe. Uh, but we realized that we had, we had developed a sort of pattern for the way we had provided the classes, the courses, and that we really needed a way to mix things up. I can say we did not have in store or in plans mixing it up by having it virtually. Uh, but I, we are very pleased that uh, so many people could attend this year. And uh, we are very pleased that we can open it up to a wide variety of people. So, um, you know, some of the obvious benefits of doing it virtually, of course, are, you know, no tra travel costs and uh, it really limits your time for traveling. Uh, anybody can come from anywhere in the world. As you can see, we're starting our sessions a lot later than we would normally if we were doing it in person, in part because we want to open this up to as many time zones as possible. Uh, Alti, as you guys probably know, is joined forces with Real Goods a number of years ago. Um, and we have West Coast, East Coast coverage in Puerto Rico, and we've expanded our operations into Latin America as well. Uh, and uh, because of our virtual nature of this conference, uh, we are opening it to uh, free to attendees uh, from wherever they are. Uh, and independent if they're installed or not, we're allowing folks to come in of all interest levels in renewable energy systems. There is the $99 uh, uh, Friday class for, with Sean White, the NABCEP uh, NEC class, as we always have typically. Now here's just, an, this is actually, this information is already old. We're up to about 400, uh, 400 attendees versus uh, same time last year. I guess 2018 was our, our previous high. Uh, so it's really delighted to know that we're gonna have so many people we can share information and knowledge with. So who, who's all attending? Well. Believe it or not, we have, as always, uh, the, the highest proportion of folks are coming with installer experience, uh, but we also have about, um, about a third of our, our folks attending are really um, tech savvy homeowners. I mentioned a lot of the folks that are in the installer crowd at one point in time before we joined this industry, we would have considered ourselves tech savvy folks too. So we welcome all of you from uh, all reaches of the world and all, all levels of interest, whether you're looking to do this for your own home 
or to do this, continue to do this uh, for your business and learning to, looking forward to the opportunity to learn more and refine your skills. Amazingly, we also found that uh, almost half of the folks were completely new to Alti. So welcome very much to you guys. Uh, Alti has been around since 1999. So we're, we're entering into, I think our 22nd year of operations. Uh, I have quite a bit more gray hair than I used to in 1999. Uh, and uh, but about as about the same amount of sleep as I used to back in 1999. But we've been proud since uh, the beginning of being uh, differentiating ourselves at Alti for not only providing uh, um, valuable products representing the best of brands across the world uh, in the renewable energy industry, but providing a deep level of technical support. Uh, whether you're talking to our technical sales folks, our our frontline sales team, or even our customer service team. Uh, or even some of our warehouse folks. So much of our team is uh, spends hours upon hours uh, and weeks, uh, in many cases, doing training to make sure that they can provide you, the, our customers, with the most, uh, the best support we possibly can. And along that level, you know, it was just it was just um, two years ago that we we opened up a new department department in our company for technical uh, technical sales support. Uh, this is for customers who are looking for help on, they bought a system, they want to know how to buy it or, the, or how to uh, install it, they have questions about how the menu works or having issues. Before we sort of put the onus on our, on our technical sales team to provide all support uh, because they're a very capable group of individuals. But we decided that we wanted to go further and we initially hired Marlon and then Roy and Dingen, who many of you may have worked with in the past. Uh, and, and to provide technical support for our whole range of products. And I've got to say, um, in this era of really reducing budgets and, uh, and customer support often being the first uh, area where things get, are on the chopping block, I'm really pleased to announce that uh, we are further expanding our technical support team with, a, with the addition of uh, Louis Stamatelos. Uh, Louis, who lives off grid himself, has been a solar installer for years and he's worked for Midnight Solar. And we're really pleased to have him on board. He's just joining on board right now and was very much looking forward to this conference. But uh, rest assured that Alti is here not only um, to help you size and um, troubleshoot systems, but really to provide that back end support that you might need to make sure your system is working correctly or your customer's uh, systems are working correctly. And I think that's one of the key ways in which uh, Alti uh, differentiate itself from from uh, well from all across the supply chain in the renewable energy industry. So welcome, welcome on board to uh, to Lewis. Well, um, first and foremost, I really want to well last but not least, I really want to thank you all very much for coming, and I really hope you enjoy the conference. I wanted to just take a quick moment to especially thank um, Andrea, Amy. Jay, who just popped on board, popped online video wise, uh, Bonnie and Jacob, really they did the bulk of the work here uh, in, for this conference, setting it up, changing the format entirely to make it a great success. You know, we, we sincerely hope that you find this conference valuable, uh, useful and enjoyable. And we look, you know, whether or not this is, becomes a virtual conference uh, next year or not, Put in your questions, put out your suggestions. We, we welcome, we always welcome the opportunity to improve this and make it better for you next year and in the future. So thank you all very much for attending. I'll pass it over to Jay. All right, thanks. Let's see, I think I need to get my cursor back. Let's see here, remote control. Okay. I think I have uh, the mouse again. Welcome, everybody. Looks like we have about 100 people online right now. So that's awesome. This is a, a great showing for our first, uh, first session of the day. Just wanted to go through a few things with you, uh, some, some conference logistics. Hopefully, you received an email similar to the one that's here on, on my screen right now. Um, you'll be getting one of these at the beginning, when, you know, once you've uh, set up your initial schedule, that'll have everything uh, that you've signed up for, at least at that time. You'll also be receiving each morning a daily digest. And this will have all the sessions that you've signed up for for today. So for instance, in, in, this, um, 
example email, <clears throat> it says I have five sessions registered for today. And uh, right in there are the links where that read more button is, you know, that would have brought me into uh, the, the correct page to, to join this meeting. And for the hundred of you that are on, you found it somehow. <laughs> um, and you'll see that there'll be those kinds of things for each of the sessions throughout the week. Just to go through the uh, schedule just quickly, um, you, you might have missed something, you can always go back and add it to your schedule later if you'd like. But today, <clears throat> after this session, we're gonna have Simplify Power, uh, then Solark, and then Victron Energy. The, each, each of these is an hour long session. And then at three o'clock, we're gonna be doing something different than this in terms of the format. It's gonna be an open network where you'll actually be able to see the other people that are here and you'll be able to speak with them. When we're all in one group, it's going to be a little bit too much to uh, have everybody talking at the same time, but we're going to have uh, individual breakout rooms for Simplify, Solark, and Victron, as well as a couple from Alt-E, and we'll have a couple of spare ones as well, where you can just go and uh, have a quick chat with somebody, um, you know, in a, in a uh, smaller session. And so we're going to have that every day at three o'clock. So it'll be scheduled for an hour and we'll see, uh, you know, we can keep it open a little bit longer if there's uh, interest there. But in that session, you'll actually be able to go uh, from room to room, essentially. So you'll, you'll be able to see where the other um, uh, suppliers are and you can go into their room and have a chat with them face to face. So this is about as close as we're going to be getting to a cocktail hour. Uh, you know, for, for this year's program. And then tomorrow we have Iron Ridge, Outback, and Midnight Solar, and then have followed uh, by out, uh, Open Networking at three o'clock. And then as we go to Wednesday, we've got uh, at 12 o'clock, Morningstar, Kilovolt at one o'clock, Schneider at two o'clock, followed by Open Networking. And then Thursday, uh, which is the last free day of the conference, we we're going to be starting with MT Solar, then S5, then Tamarack Solar, and then uh, our final networking session of, uh, you know, of the uh, main conference. And then on Friday is a, a paid session. In the past, when we've done these uh, programs in person, we've often had this session be one of the first sessions on, on like the Monday in the uh, afternoon of Monday, but we went to this format to uh, have as much of the content in and around noontime, um, you know, even as you, as you go further west, one of these sessions is at your noontime. And we wanted to do that because we figured that would be easier uh, to fit into your schedule, kind of a lunch and learn. On the networking sessions, <clears throat> you know, each day you probably have seen when you signed up, that there are some giveaways by each of these vendors. For those of you that have been to our physical conferences in the past, we usually have um, you know, a drawing on uh, the afternoon of the last day and uh, go through and, and draw out of a hat everybody's names and then you get a chance to win you know, a lot of these great gifts. Some of these things are $1,000 or, or more uh, in value. So, you know, it's really a, a good thing to, um, you know, to be a part of. And we appreciate all of the suppliers providing these, uh, you know, to you, our, our uh, attendees. This year, what we're going to do is we're going to announce the winners during the open networking session of the day that that um, company made their technical session. So, for instance, for today, if we go back to today's agenda, um, Simplify, Solark, and Victron will be having drawings for their giveaways uh, this afternoon starting at three o'clock. You don't actually need to be there to win, but it's more fun if you are there. So uh, we'd encourage you to, to join us for that open networking session, even if you didn't attend all of the sessions uh, for the day. And so let's see how we're doing on time. Well, we're getting there. Um, just a couple of other quick points. For those of you that are looking to get NABSEP credits, they will be issued after the conference by the vendor. So we're going to be providing them a list of the names and emails of those folks that attended 
um, each of the different sessions and providing that to the uh, manufacturer. And then they will go and uh, submit your, your information for the one hour credits for each of those sessions. And as I said, just a second ago, the session giveaways will be announced at the open networking session each day. So um, it's about 10 minutes to noon. Our official first session is gonna be at noon and that will be Simplify. So in your, uh, your daily email, if you signed up for the Simplify session, you should have the link for that that you'll be able to go to shortly. My alarm is just going off reminding me it's 10 minutes, so getting ready to go. Um, that, is, uh, that is all that we have for, for today, for right now. Uh, I hope that you join us for Simplify and um, Solark and Victron later today, and I'll be seeing you at the open networking session later. I see I have a couple of um, questions here, so yes. Uh, I see a question from Glenn about NABSEP credits, which I think I just answered. Uh, he said that had some challenges last year. We'll, we'll work on that, um, you know, with the suppliers, make sure it goes better. And I have a question from David here. Uh, all we need to do is sign up for the giveaways to sign up and attend the vendors class. So yes, for the, for the, for the giveaways, if you signed up uh, and then you show up, then you'll be included in the in the chances to win the giveaways. It's going to be a random drawing, and we'll make it uh, we'll make the announcements live at the open networking session. Okay. So for now, then, uh, oh, let's see one more question: Will the session recordings be available afterwards? Yes, we are uh, working out the details, but our intention is to have them available within 24 or 48 hours after the session. To have them uh, posted. Okay. So for that, I'm going to uh, call this session to a close. Uh, I, I appreciate everybody joining us here, and uh, we look forward to seeing you in the next sessions. Thanks again. Take care.